Hey, my friends, we will be right back to the show, but I have a question for you. Are you struggling with the impact of childhood trauma? Well, know that you're not alone. I'm here to let you know that I'm starting a brand new weekly coaching group that includes a year of live coaching, accountability, support, habit and goal setting, and more. I'm starting a wait list for the group right now, and I'm only taking a handful of people. And I'll let you know that through this personalized coaching, we'll work together to help you understand how your childhood trauma has shaped your beliefs, behaviors, emotions, and will help you create a roadmap for healing and growth. Right now, you can schedule an absolutely free coaching session with me and get put on the wait list if you go to thinkunbroken.com. My friends, it's your time to turn your trauma into triumph, breakdowns into breakthroughs, and become the hero of your own story. And I'm here to support you in doing that. Just go to thinkunbroken.com to register for a free coaching call with me and to get put on the wait list for the brand new weekly coaching program. We'll be right back to the show. But before we do, I want to tell you about today's sponsor, Factor Mills. Dot com, where if you go to factormills.com slash unbroken50 and use the code unbroken50, you can get 50% off your first order. That's factormills.com slash unbroken50. If you're like me and you are a person who is busy trying to create a life, heal, work on their health, wealth, and relationships, and not to mention deal with the day-to-days of normal life, you do not have time to be going to the grocery store and trying to figure out what you're going to cook every single day of the week. In fact, one time I did the math and I realized I was spending over 15 hours a week at the grocery store and cooking. When I added factor, I got to use that time for myself, for my family, for my friends, for my community, and for my business. And so if you're in the place where you need some more support in the kitchen, head to factormills.com slash unbroken50 and use the code unbroken50 to get 50% off. Hey, my friends, we will be right back to the show, but I have a question for you. Are you struggling with the impact of childhood trauma? Well, know that you're not alone. I'm here to let you know that I'm starting a brand new weekly coaching group that includes a year of live coaching, accountability, support, habit and goal setting, and more. I'm starting a wait list for the group right now, and I'm only taking a handful of people. And I'll let you know that through this personalized coaching, we'll work together to help you understand how your childhood trauma has shaped your beliefs, behaviors, emotions, and will help you create a roadmap for healing and growth. Right now, you can schedule an absolutely free coaching session with me and get put on the wait list if you go to thinkunbroken.com. My friends, it's your time to turn your trauma into triumph, breakdowns into breakthroughs, and become the hero of your own story. And I'm here to support you in doing that. Just go to thinkunbroken.com to register for a free coaching call with me and to get put on the wait list for the brand new weekly coaching program. Hey, my friends, we will be right back to the show. But I have a question for you. Are you struggling with the impact of childhood trauma? Well, know that you're not alone. I'm here to let you know that I'm starting a brand new weekly coaching group that includes a year of live coaching, accountability, support, habit and goal setting, and more. I'm starting a wait list for the group right now, and I'm only taking a handful of people. And I'll let you know that through this personalized coaching, we'll work together to help you understand how your childhood trauma has shaped your beliefs, behaviors, emotions, and will help you create a roadmap for healing and growth. Right now, you can schedule an absolutely free coaching session with me and get put on the wait list if you go to thinkunbroken.com. My friends, it's your time to turn your trauma into triumph, breakdowns into breakthroughs, and become the hero of your own story. And I'm here to support you in doing that. Just go to thinkunbroken.com to register for a free coaching call with me and to get put on the wait list for the brand new weekly coaching program. Community, connection, and commitment. I call it the three C's. I think that these are probably one of the most important acronyms in probably anything that I teach in Think Unbroken because the reality and the truth about this is everything that is next in your life is going to revolve around this baseline. So many people come into this idea of healing 
around trauma and think to themselves, I can do it on my own. I'll read a book. I'll go to a course. I'll download a video. I'll listen to a podcast. uh, And that'll be that. That shit doesn't work. I fucking promise you. The truth about it is that if you want to actually succeed, if you want to prosper in this, you're going to have to align yourself with community. You're going to have to be committed to it and you're going to have to have the connection to it. And I'll dive into that here in just a second. One of the things that's really important about what is next in this journey for you is recognizing the truth of the reality of the human experience. Doesn't matter where you are right now, but you can be the person that you want to be. You can, it's possible. Trust me, I've done it. Hundreds of my clients have done it. Thousands of people who have taken my courses have done it. And you can do it too. That's not fucking hyperbole. Like that's real talk. You can go look at any of the reviews at thinkunbroken.com. You can read any of the reviews of the podcast at thinkunbrokenpodcast.com. You can go check out my social media. The reason why people get stuck here is because they've aligned themselves in this idea that they are never going to make it to what's next. And that they have to do this process alone and that they have to heal by themselves. And that's bullshit. And it's not going to work for you. And so if you think that what is next in your life is going to happen because you went to the library and you sat down for two hours or you watched a video or you listened to a podcast, you're out of your mind. It's just not going to work. And I want to shoot it straight with you because I think it's really important. And here's why. My mentor, Tom Bill, you taught me this and I'm going to teach it to you. The struggle is guaranteed. The success is not. The struggle is guaranteed. The success is not. And what that means when you really break it down is that in order to find success in your life, you're going to have to align yourself by doing the right things all the time. You may have heard this ideation or this idea that how you do anything is how you do everything, and that's so incredibly true. And so if you think that you're going to be successful in your life by yourself, you're in for a rude awakening. And I don't want to be like the bearer of bad news here, and that's not what my agenda or my goal is in giving you this as a preface, but instead it's to tell you that alignment is everything in this journey. You have to understand the truth about what is next, and that truth is In order for you to find success, you are going to have to be willing to be communal, to ask for help, to be connected to the right people, and then ultimately commit to what is next in your future. Because I'm telling you, no one has ever done anything great by themselves. Nobody. Not good people, not evil people. Like, no bullshit. Think about this for a second. Hitler did not take over Germany by himself. He didn't. Walt Disney did not build the biggest company on planet Earth by himself. Zucks did not build Facebook by himself, right? I mean, even though he might want to think he did, he didn't, right? We we all need that. We all need that connection to a community with the commitment to drive us forward towards our mission. And I understand that in reading this, you go, yeah, but those people are different. They're fucking not different. They're not. The difference between them and And you and where you may be today is that you have not yet accepted the reality from the social conditioning of your experience of your childhood, your family, your parents, your teachers, your coaches, your peers, that you can't somehow figure out how to be in control of your life. We'll be right back to today's show. But first, I need to ask you a question. Are you feeling stuck? Are you feeling like you don't have the support to go to the next level in your healing journey? Are you feeling like you wish you had a little bit more support from not only myself, but the Unbroken Nation? Well, my friend, I want to invite you to come and join our live weekly coaching sessions in Think Unbroken. All you have to do is go to keys, K-E-Y-S, keys.thinkunbroken.com to sign up and join us today with 100% money back, no questions asked, guaranteed and no contract or commitment every week for the next year. You can come and be a part of our live coaching sessions each Monday as we dive deep into not only answering your questions, but questions from the unbroken nation and help you take all of the information that you learn in the podcast, in the courses and other areas of this journey, bring them into your life and use it in a way that is practical, life-changing and transformative. So my friend, join us at keys.thinkunbroken.com. And we will see you this Monday. You grow up in this situation where everyone tells you how you have to act and who you have to be. We know this. We talked about it. 
And now you're at this position in your life where you've convinced yourself so much that your identity is the loner, that your identity is I will figure it out on my own. I raise my hand being one of the first people guilty in having this identity for a very long time. It is no longer my identity. My identity is now tied to the idea that I know that I cannot do this alone. That is why I have mentors. I have coaches. I have people on my team who help me grow and build and be the best version of myself. And if you want to grow and build and be the best version of yourself, you're going to have to have that shit too, period. And so what I want you to think about is, have you positioned your mindset and your identity in a way that doesn't give you the space to go towards connection with other human beings to create the life that you want to have? So let's break this down. The first C is community. And it's also the most important word, I believe, in the trauma healing journey because community is going to help you be seen and heard and felt and often for many people it's going to give you a safe space to step into really hard fucking conversations so that you can face your truth to come out the other side you have to have community in this when i was 30 i went to probably one of the most uncomfortable situations in my life when I stepped into men's group therapy. I was terrified. It was so fucking uncomfortable. But in that, I built community. In that, I built compassion. In that, I built this group of people who saw me for the truth about who I am and what I'm capable of. And I've been to AA, NNA, NSA, and all the A's. And I've been in group mentoring programs and group coaching programs and the whole nine. And the the truth is, and the reason why I still continue to do them is because that's where I can connect with people in a beautiful way that doesn't leave me feeling alone. I'm going to keep it real with you. Social media, forums, Facebook chats, group texts. That stuff is not community in the way that I believe is the most beneficial. Yes, of course it is community because it gives you a place to exist with other people, but there's nothing I have discovered more powerful than being in a community of people with a very specific connection. And that's what we're going to talk about next. The second C, connection. You see, it's easy to get in community. You can be in a community on a basketball league, on a racing team, a chess club, the gym, I don't know, D&D. The list goes on and on and on, right? Connection, however, matters so much because it's not going to do you a lot of good to be involved with communities that are not in alignment with what you're trying to accomplish, with what you're trying to cultivate or what you're trying to build in your life. The connection is really important because you're going to be in this position where, especially if you're coming through this place of healing and you're trying to step into what's next in your life, you're going to need to be around people who understand and get this because they're doing the same damn thing. If you're in connection with a community of people who are naysayers and doubters and want to bring you down and tell you, oh, why are you doing that? I don't understand. That stuff doesn't work. It's bullshit. I'm telling you right now you're going to fail. You're going to fail because we are a beautiful, even though I know this is difficult to to, to read or hear, we are a beautiful amalgamation of the people around us, right? And that can be good or bad. It really can. And if you're around people who always just want to bring you down, do you think you're going to be successful? If you're around naysayers, do you think you're going to be successful? One of the hardest things that I've ever had to do in my life is when I was 18 years old, Not only did I stop being friends with my best friend, I took my mother out of my life and I told her I would never talk to you again. And I ostracized myself from a community of people that I knew if I continued to be in connection with that I was going to end up dead or in jail. And that at the time carried shame and guilt because I didn't understand it. But in hindsight and in retrospect, I recognize it's actually probably one of the greatest decisions I've ever made in my life. Because if you don't put yourself first, nobody else will. And in putting yourself first, when you're in a group of people who are also putting themselves first but are moving towards a shared goal or idea, 
you're going to have a lot of support and success in that. Because when you get in this group of people who are like, yes, let's heal, let's grow, let's change, let's overcome, let's support, let's hold each other accountable, and ultimately let's have each other's back, you're going to be in for an amazing surprise about what your future can be. Hey, what's up, Unbroken Nation? We'll be right back to today's episode, but I want to take a moment and invite you to Think Unbroken Conference. That's right. Our next conference is happening right around the corner this December with amazing speakers from around the world who are leaders in personal development, trauma education, mindset, and more. All you have to do to register to watch for free, that's right, $0. Come and join us is go to myunbrokenlife.com, register and sign up. You can get access to the free event. Watch it live with us this December. It'll be myself speaking along with amazing human beings like Anthony Trucks, Jamie Bronstein, Leslie Logan, and a special interview that I'm doing with Dr. Gabor Mate that has never before been released. So come and join us, myunbrokenlife.com. All you have to do is put in your email. We'll send you over the registration. You'll be able to come and join us, watch live. And then if you want access to the recordings or more information there for you to keep them forever. But in the meantime, go sign up block it off on your calendar. This is going to be a transformational experience that you do not want to miss. Head over to myunbrokenlife.com to register for free. Until next time, be unbroken. The last C is commitment. And the reason why this last C is commitment is because if you do not commit, this is not going to work. If you do, let me, I'm going to say that again. I want you to hear this again. If you do not commit, this shit will not work because you're going to have to deploy a tremendous amount of patience. Tremendous. This healing journey, I promise you, is going to take you longer than you think. Right now, today, where you're at, isn't where you're going to be tomorrow or even after you finish what you're listening to or reading right now. But I will tell you this, and I share this with my clients all the time. I found a very beautiful sense of peace in my journey when I came to realize that unfortunately or fortunately, depending on the day I'm having, to be honest with you, that this is a lifelong journey. Healing trauma is a lifetime journey. Overcoming the past is a lifetime journey because we are the sum total of all of our experiences. And that means that every experience that we've ever had informs who we are. And since those experiences inform who we are, it sets precedent for understanding truth. And that truth is that you are always going to be in a position of trying to move forward. And that's not a bad thing because without momentum, you stagnate and in stagnation, you die. That's where death is. Death is a lack of movement. Right? You hear a lot of people talk about businesses. If they're not growing, they're dying. And so one of the really incredible things that I've been able to do in terms of the way I look at my identity is to simply look at the experiences that I've had as a catalyst that have given me the tools to go forward while understanding that those experiences also are going to require a lifetime of attention in the right ways to navigate. I still get triggered. I still get incredibly angry. I still have moments in which I will revert to old behavior patterns. I still break down. I still cry. I still get lost. I still get frustrated. But whereas a decade ago, those experiences of that stimulus would keep me triggered or in a spiral for weeks or even months, now it's minutes. Minutes. Could you imagine this? I want you to think about this for a second. If you got triggered hard and you had this really hard fucking day or this really dark experience. And instead of it destroying your day, which led to your week, which turned into a month and ultimately a year. But instead, what if it lasted one minute or one hour? Do you think that would impact your life in some kind of incredible way? I do. And I see it every single day. I see it with my clients. I see it with people I coach. I see it with people who consume the content that I put out into the world. 
And that's why I say that this commitment is forever because you're going to get triggered again. It's going to happen, whether it's at work or with a partner or at the gym or driving down the street. I've had moments in my life where a smell has triggered me. You can probably relate to this, right? And so in that, when you recognize that those triggers in terms of time can dissipate more and more every day, then you really start to take control over your future. And I have these moments and I see it in my clients too where we'll have these stretches for weeks and sometimes months where we're just on fire. We're crushing life. Everything is awesome. And then one thing happens. And when that one thing happens, you can spiral. And I see this and I know that it's true. Or you can overcome And the overcoming process comes in leveraging the tools at your disposal, the things that we'll go through, the things that we dive in together. When you step into the courses, when you step into the classes, when you read the books that we have produced at Think Unbroken to help you become the hero of your own story. And so as you head into what's next, I want you to just think about the value of the three C's in your life and what it would mean in your healing journey to have community, connection, and commitment. Unbroken Nation, I want to thank you so much for listening. It means the world to me that you're here with me today. It means the world to me that you'd be a part of this community. As we continue to grow, just know that my number one goal is to bring you as much value as humanly possible. So please like, subscribe, comment, share, tell a friend. And until next time, my friends, be unbroken. I'll see ya. Hey, Unbroken Nation. We'll be right back to the show, but I wanted to let you know that you can grab a copy of my first book, Think Unbroken, Understanding and Overcoming Childhood Trauma for free. If you go to book.thinkunbroken.com, you can download the PDF ebook version of the book and get everything that I know about the baseline of healing trauma for free downloaded to your email right now. Just go to book.thinkunbroken.com to download your copy of Think Unbroken, Understanding and Overcoming Childhood Trauma for a PDF for your phone. Again, that is book.thinkunbroken.com. Thank you so much for listening to Think Unbroken. Please share this episode with someone who could use it and help us move forward in our mission of ending generational trauma in our lifetime. And if you would, please take five seconds to pop on iTunes or Spotify, hit that five star, leave a review, and you can also reach out to us on social at Michael Unbroken or at Think Unbroken. And of course, you can check out our YouTube channel at Think Unbroken. Thank you for being a part of Unbroken Nation, my friends, and until next time, be unbroken. Hey, my friends, we will be right back to the show, but I have a question for you. Are you struggling with the impact of childhood trauma? Well, know that you're not alone. I'm here to let you know that I'm starting a brand new weekly coaching group that includes a year of live coaching, accountability, support, habit and goal setting, and more. I'm starting a wait list for the group right now, and I'm only taking a handful of people. And I'll let you know that through this personalized coaching, we'll work together to help you understand how your childhood trauma has shaped your beliefs, behaviors, emotions, and will help you create a roadmap for healing and growth. Right now, you can schedule an absolutely free coaching session with me and get put on the wait list if you go to thinkunbroken.com. My friends, it's your time to turn your trauma into triumph, breakdowns into breakthroughs, and become the hero of your own story. And I'm here to support you in doing that. Just go to thinkunbroken.com to register for a free coaching call with me and to get put on the wait list for the brand new weekly coaching program.